tell you a little bit about camera basics. We're gonna start with different parts of a camera and then talk about the main exposure controls of a camera. So, parts of a camera. Here is a basic DSLR camera. Uh, the DSLR stands for Digital Single Lens Reflex. And what that means is that we have the lens and the reflex part is that in most, uh, well in DSLRs or SLRs, non-digital versions, there is a mirror that's right here and it pops up when you take the photo. So that's all that really means. Um, when people talk about mirrorless cameras, it just means that there is no mirror. That instead of popping up, uh, the sensor, which is right back here, just turns on and off. So let's start with number one, we have the lens, right? The body is this whole area here. And so on this diagram, it's lens and then the body of the camera. The mirror is this part here. And the mirror, uh, its really only function is to take the image that's coming in through the lens and then pop it up into another series of mirrors right up here so that you can see through the viewfinder what you're actually taking a photo of, okay? Um, right back here is the sensor, okay? And that's the part that's actually reading the light that's coming into your camera. And we have the viewfinder, it's right here. The shutter release, which is the button you hit to take the photo. The hot shoe, which is where you would put a flash on or other types of devices like um, some cameras that don't automatically come with Wi-Fi, you can put in a Wi-Fi receiver. And then the mode dial, which is the different modes that you can take photos of on a camera. Um, so when you take a photo, the light is coming through the lens and then this you hit the shutter release button and the mirror will pop up and the shutter will actually open letting all the light coming into your camera to hit the sensor.